Located in downtown Las Vegas, Nevada, Vault 21 was one of the few vaults that successfully protected its inhabitants while fulfilling the perimeters of its experiment. Everyone in the vault was equal. It was created with a perfectly symmetrical layout and all conflicts and problems were solved through gambling. Chosen dwellers would gamble against each other in the main atrium and the winner would earn the right to settle the dispute however they wished. Sarah Weintraub describes it as pure New Vegas as everyone has a chance and Lady Luck smiles if you play your odds right. In the year 2274, Robert House contacted Vault 21's residents with an offer of inclusion in the resurrection of Vegas. While most of the vault dwellers wanted to refuse this offer, some of the residents were in favor of it. As a result, residents in favor of Mr. House's offer challenged each level's representative who was in favor of staying isolated. After a game of blackjack that lasted many hours, those in favor of opening the door to the outside world won in an extremely risky move. Soon after, Mr. House ordered the vault to be filled with concrete. However, at the request of Sarah and Sheldon Weintraub, he left the upper levels intact and allowed Sarah to establish a hotel there, which became another source of income for Vegas's growing economy. After their emergence, many vault dwellers went to live new lives in the outside world, such as Doc Mitchell himself. 